So, what do you do? And I've been a lawyer for a long time. What kind of lawyer are you? Uh, insurance defense, litigation, trial lawyer. What do you do? I do a couple of things. I am in corporate HR, and I'm also a hip hop artist. I am a puppeteer. I did some training with Sesame Street, and I've been affiliated with the Muppets. I tutor children, and when they get to around sixth, seventh grade, that's kind of, kind of when I say, OK, guys. <laughs> what do you think 10-year-old you would think of yourself right now if they saw you today? Actually, 10-year-old me wanted to be a barber. So my 10-year-old would probably say, how the hell did you become a lawyer? <laughs> Really, my favorite is to teach kids how to read. I, I used to teach dyslexic kids in Atlanta, and so I love tutoring children that have difficulties reading because I know I can help them. What would 10-year-old you say? I think when I was 10, I wanted to be a veterinarian because I love animals. And if they saw that I was a puppeteer, I think 10-year-old me at the time would have thought that that was really weird because I don't think that when I was 10, I knew that being a puppeteer was a career. Is this what you imagined yourself doing as an adult? Um, not the HR part. The being an artist, yes. I knew from 14 that I was gonna be an artist. Passionate about anything else? I mean, as far as just living life and making sure that I stay healthy, and I'm very passionate about just, um, it's about spiritual and physical health. Like, what was it like for you growing up? just lived in the suburbs and I didn't really see too many people different from me. I tell people I lived in a bubble kind of until I moved to Atlanta. It was similar for me until I got to college. Most people, you know, kind of look like me <laughs> where, I'm, where I'm from, so same thing. I just lost 63 pounds. Oh, congratulations, that's great. <laughs> I lost half a person, yeah, I feel much better. <laughs> great. Makes a big difference. Keep at the gym now, then. To get yeah, it all back exactly, consistency shape. is the big thing, right? Right, absolutely, yeah, yeah, you gotta keep at it. You can't stop. Corey, you are 34. You are white, and I'm imagining that you have curly hair. A cute shirt that says something positive on it, some shorts. You are from Virginia. <laughs> okay, well, I'd say you're 30 years old, around 30, 30 to 36. Not short hair, uh, maybe medium length or longer. Say you're maybe wearing a, maybe a pantsuit or slacks like in a, in a, slacks and a blouse. I think you're 42. You are African American. You are wearing like a blue blouse. <laughs> you wear, you have brownish black hair and that's a little bit long. You are from Chicago. Probably late 50s or early 60s, I'm guessing. I, I, I feel like brown or salt and pepper hair. And I feel like you're wearing a suit too because you said you're an insurance lawyer. Curly hair. No, no. <laughs> curly natural. No. Okay. I'm trying to be right here with something. Yeah, okay, what about hair. where where are you from? I'm from New York. New I York! I almost had it. So right. I almost on. had it. Where are you from? I'm, I'm from Michigan. Shoot. <laughs> <laughs> but I like Virginia. That was good. Oh man. How how old are you? 30. Oh. So maybe I'll tell you later. Oh man. Right around there. Maybe I shouldn't, maybe I shouldn't say. Oh, I think we were pretty both close. We were close, yeah. I, I was not right about the hair at all, but... Uh, well, you know, I'm just... But I was right about the suit. Your shoulder length hair, mm -hmm. maybe it's a little darker than I thought. And at your age, you're probably about 35 or uh, 32? I'm 30. Oh, oh there you yeah, go. So I said 30. Okay. Close enough. How about you? How old are you? Uh, or how okay. old, roughly? Oh, roughly. I'm, I'm, I'm around where you said. It's just a little higher. Maybe a little higher than Okay. You, said. you got the suit. How did you know I was wearing a suit? I don't, I don't know. know. Well, when you said that you're an insurance lawyer, that made me think like, okay, and, sh and lawyers wear suits, so maybe yeah. he's wearing a suit. Like, are we gonna be friends? Yes! Okay. I am your first friend in LA. Well, not my first. Okay. But you're, you're still <laughs> very important. You're in the top five. I'm, a, I'm in the top five. Yeah, you're yes. like my fourth. Hey, you've been here for five weeks. Yeah. I think I'm just happy to meet you happy. in this time. Let's give this a try. Hold on, here's just a random puppet. Oh, not, my puppet looks like me. I guess so, <laughs> sure. I don't normally play uh, old guys in scrubs, but 
Oh, yeah. Oh, and normally I have hand puppets, but again, this is I okay. Just, so I, you're gonna do a voice. You're gonna do a man's voice. For I that can puppet? see if I can do a little man's voice and teach all you kids about what the medical field is like <laughs> if I want to. Hi, Kelly. Okay. <laughs> it was so nice meeting you. It was so you. nice meeting you. Thank Wonderful. you so much so for talking with me. I've never met, like I said, I've never met a puppeteer. Thank no, you. I can. So pancake.